Hello, Zuko here, and I just heard about the Booktubeathon a couple days ago, and I decided that I wanted to try to participate this year and read seven books next week. Wish me luck, because I have things to do next week also. Also, totally off topic, but I almost forgot to put a shirt on to film this, which probably wouldn't have been the best idea. Though maybe my views would have, like, gone up a lot. I don't know. Um, but I put a shirt on, so sorry? Or you're welcome. So for the first challenge, there is read a book with a person on the cover. For that, I chose Roald Dahl's The Complete Adventures of Charlie and Mr. Willy Wonka. Uh, so, I mean, do those count as people? They're people. They're just, they're just drawn people and kind of weird drawn people. For the challenge of read a hyped book, I chose Aragon by Christopher Poloni. Uh, I don't think this book is hyped anymore, but I wanted to read it mostly because I want to know if I want to get rid of it and not finish the series. Because I want to get into fantasy, but I've heard this is an actually good fantasy, so I don't think it's going to make me want to continue. For the challenge of finish a book in one day, I'm going to be honest, I finished most of my books in one day, so I didn't pick a specific book for it, so I'll just grab one. I want to read Suck It Up by Brian Meal. This is about a vampire who is like trying to go vegan or something. I don't know. I bought it on discount because I like vampires, <laughs> but I'm hoping to read this during Booktubeathon. The next challenge is read a book with a character who is not like you, I believe. Um, so I chose Looking for Alaska by John Green. I haven't read this, so I don't know if the character is not like me, but I assume she is because most John Green characters are not like me. The next challenge is read a book completely outdoors, which I know has everybody very uh, concerned because nobody wants to be outdoors. We're all book readers here. We want to sit inside and cozy up with our book on the couch. But uh, I chose the graphic novel for The Last Unicorn by Peter S. Beagle. Um, I've watched the movie when I was little and I wanted to read a graphic novel since I bought it a long time ago. The next challenge is read a book you bought because of the cover and that would be Vengeance Road by Aaron Bowman uh, because the cover is beautiful and I love it. And the final and seventh challenge is read seven books. So for the last book I have John Conley's The Book of Lost Things. I think the cover is really pretty and I'm getting distracted watching it in the viewfinder. I'm not exactly sure what this book is about so I can't tell you. But that is my 2017 book Tubathon TBR. Hopefully I can get through these. I will post a uh, wrap-up specific to the Booktubeathon on Sunday next week, when the day that the Booktubeathon ends. And then I'll be posting my normal wrap-up on Monday, or else I might post the end of this on Monday and then the next one on, like, Wednesday. Uh, so yeah, I hope you all enjoyed it, and I'll see you whenever I do my next video.